Wait. Okay, welcome to Tip of the Week. All right, this is what we're going to try and do. We're going to film some short little films to try and give you a little bit of a hand to try and make sure what we can do is help you keep your bike in good order. What we're going to do today is throttle cable tension. Something that's madly, madly over, uh, overlooked and, and missed by, by many people's uh, 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 sort of work ethics, etc., even in workshops. So don't worry if you, if you don't understand anything about it. I'm here to show you what's going on. What I'm going to show you is how to set up the throttle cable tension on, on a Tuono, but what we'll do is, is this will work for any particular bike. It doesn't matter what it is. Um, there's been a lot of uh, cloud and controversy about how to set up this in the past, but the method is, and this is it, you can probably tell I've done this before, is you need to keep uh, the throttle tension or the throttle cable tension as tight as you can without moving, uh, sorry, without upsetting the uh, tick over or the throttle operation when you move the bars from lock to lock. Let me show you what's going on if you... By the way, this is Darren's bike. Sorry, Darren, this wasn't... Uh, I've artificially put quite a lot of tension in there. Please don't worry. I'm really, really sorry. Okay, let's come and have a look at this. If you have a look at this, this free play here, this free play is quite normal. This is what we see a lot of the time. The throttle moves okay, but this free play in the first section is too much. So what we need to be able to do is set this, the adjusters here, we need to be able to wind this on and take out as much of this throttle cable tension as we can while still being able to use the throttle normally like this can you see it's starting to don't misunderstand that the, the flex in the throttle tube for free play so when we move the bars from lock to lock so we'll just move the bar from lock to lock see if that works still and again that still seems okay. If we over tighten it and put too much on, let's see what happens again. Nothing to the throttle operation, but let's see what happens when we start the bike. So if you just move back a sec, guys, what we'll do is we'll try and start the bike. <laughs> Don't forget to turn the lock nut back on, lock it off. Done. Okay, gents, this makes a massive difference to the sensation of, of, uh, of you being attached to your bike. The lag in the transmission will have disappeared, and it does make an awful lot of difference. Don't trust me, like I said. Give it a try and see what you think. Just remember, the way to do it is you should be able to get the throttle cable as tight as you can without affecting the engine RPM, okay, or the throttle operation when you move the bars from lock to lock. See you next week. Thanks very much.